Hello, my name is Caitlin Lipper. The book I would like to talk to you about today is Glass by Ellen Hopkins. Ellen Hopkins was adopted at birth by an older couple. She grew up in Palm Springs, California. The real story behind Crank took place between the years 1995 and 2001. Ellen's most popular writing style is poetry. The books most people know her for are Impulse, Perfect, and Identical. Christina thinks she can control it. Now with a baby to care for, she's determined to be the one deciding when and how much, the one calling the shots. But the monster is too strong, and before she knows it, Christina is back in its grips. She needs the monster to keep going, to face the pressures of day-to-day -day life. She needs it to feel alive. Once again, the monster takes over Christina's life, and she will do anything for it, including giving up the one person who gives her the unconditional love she craves, her baby. The main character in this book is Christina Georgia Snow, a teenage mother who just recently turned 18. Used to be a straight A student, now she is thinner than a piece of paper, dropped out of high school, and on the way down to a crash. Another character in this story is Trey. He is Katrina's boyfriend, love of her life. He is a muscular guy, very tall and tan. He is mostly sarcastic and kind of a jerk. He tends to lie a lot and sleep around. Another main character is Brad. Brad is Trey's cousin. He helps Christina and Trey's love of meth. Throughout this book, it tells us about Christina's struggles with meth, with, the, with trying to quit and get her baby back. But each and every time she fails and crashes harder. My favorite part of this novel is whenever Christina realizes it would be better for her for her mother to have her baby rather than herself. It is important because she plans on giving him a better life than she would be able to give him. This novel relates to her life in many ways. Many families have to deal with meth addicts and the struggles women lose their children all the time because of drug addictions. I recommend reading Crank before you read Glass. They are outstanding books. I would give them a 4 out of 5.